guys, welcome back to my channel. If you guys haven't been following me on Facebook, I have been talking about my permanent make permanent everything for the past couple of weeks, but I have discovered something that is really amazing and that is the awesomeness that is permanent lash perming. So if you have lashes like mine that are wimpy, 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 they just don't stand up at all when you curl your lashes with the lash curler. You can definitely benefit from this. Basically what lash perming is, is just like perming your hair. You permanently put a curl in your eyelashes. The great thing about this is that you can finally get rid of your lash curler. So this three right here, this medieval piece of eye torture, you can finally take it out back and just bury it. <laughs> With the permed lashes, I can put on the mascara and it doesn't get limpy during the day. So great how it just stands straight up. And I'm just going to show you guys how I would perm my lashes with this kit. So we're gonna go ahead and get started with the demo. Okay, so if you look at my lashes, they are pretty straight. No life whatsoever. I mean, I do have pretty long lashes, so yay for me, but they're just limp and sad. To start off, I'm going to clean my eye really well. Um, you don't want any oils around your eye while you're doing this. Now because my lashes are stick straight, it's really hard to perm your lashes. So the best way to do this is to actually pre-curl your lashes and um, just curl it as you normally would. Okie dokes, the kit is going to come with this pack of sticky tubes. Um, they're really, really sticky. I don't know what else to call them, but they do come in different sizes, small, medium, and large. I'm going to use the large one to curl my lashes and I'm just gonna peel it right off from the packaging. And I'm going to bend it a little bit because I want it to fit the curvature of my eye. Okay, so here is kind of the tricky part. You're gonna have to place it as closely as you can to the lash line. So imagine yourself putting on falsies, but not trying to have it stick to your lashes. Um, as you can see, I was having trouble with focusing my camera because it is very close to my eye and this is very hard to do. Now with a pair of tweezers, I'm going to push my lashes onto the sticky tube and it should stick to the tube. Um, if it doesn't, you can actually apply some lash glue onto your lashes and then just slick it onto the tube. That works really well. Okay, so the lash perming kit comes with four little tubes. As you guys can see, I only have three here because I dropped the third one and it broke. Luckily for me, the third one isn't really that important. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to use the pink tubey and I am going to dip my cotton bud in there and just apply a nice helping layer onto my lashes. And after I got a nice generous amount coating all of my lashes, I wait for about 10 minutes. Now if you have super straight lashes, I highly recommend waiting from 15 to 20 minutes and that's what I did and it works a lot better for me. And now we are going to go towards the blue vial and once again to dip a cotton bud into the blue vial and apply a nice heaping layer onto your lashes. So this is supposed to be the thing that keeps your lashes stay permed for as long as it can. And again, you're gonna wait about 10 minutes for this, but if you have really straight lashes just like mine, then you should wait about 15 to 20 minutes. Okay, so the very last vial is the cleaning up vial and you're going to dip your cotton bud in there and just clean up everything that is around your lashes and if you want, you could kind of rub your lashes a little bit and it'll help remove it from the sticky foam tubey things. Um, it actually takes a little bit of effort but if you're patient, you can kind of just rub it a little bit off. If not, you can just be like me and totally just peel the little foam thingy off and ta-da, your lashes are now permed and curled. And it's amazing because when I wake up, my lashes still look perky just like this and all I have to do is apply mascara onto it and my mascara will stay on all day long. And yeah, that's pretty much it. It takes about 40 minutes to go through all of the steps. You know, your lashes grows in cycles, so I would do a pick-me-up once a month. As always, everything is linked in the bottom bar for you guys if you're interested in this kit. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you guys so much for watching this. If you want, please um, support me by liking the video, sharing it with others, and of course, subscribing to my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll talk to you guys later, and remember to rock on, slow bees. Bye!
guys, Lobies! Welcome back to another DIY. I was going to make this dress for New Year's Eve, but then I got really busy, so I never got around to it. And I decided, you know, why let this idea go to waste when I could just make it as a Valentine's Day dress? I absolutely love this dress because it's 